All right, welcome back to your Daily Flash. It's time for another uh, it's exciting edition of Does It Work? This is where we take those as seen on TV products and put them to test and see if they actually work. And today we have the Easy Fresh Pizza Reheating Tray that okay. you can get right off of the, uh, as you see on TV. So we're gonna ask, does it work or not? It says it's easy as one, two, three. It retails for about $7.99. Inside of it, you get two tr pizza trays, okay. okay? The concept is, is when you, sometimes when you put pizza in a microwave, it, it gets, gets all really, hard. Yeah. Well, this is supposed to get rid of that. And basically what it is, is a tray. You set yourself a slice of pizza on there and they have a little reservoir right here where I you see. just pour some water into and which what we will do right now. And then you would just put it in the microwave for the normal amount of time, about one minute or so, which we have already done. Right. If you want to go in there and grab, uh, we put in already one minute, and there's your slice of pie in the microwave that we had used oh, the other because it's- Oh, doesn't look hard. So it doesn't look, <clears throat> feel, pick it up, see if it's, it still is- Has know, a nice flop to it. A lot of the times what will happen to on the top of your pizza mm -hmm. too, you'll get that nasty, uh, it won't really heat yeah. all the way through. Also it's not too soggy on the bottom, I don't know if That's a big deal that. if you use yeah. too much water on it. Give it a shot there and you're gonna tell us, does it work? If it's still, it, does it taste, is it too oh, hard? Oh, this works. Okay, so right, all right, does work. This now works. keep in mind, the concept is just put pizza with some water, mm -hmm. okay? You could do the same thing with a plate and a cup of water. All you have to do is put it inside the microwave. Sure. Very easy concept. Another way you can warm up some pizza is throw it into the oven, but then you gotta preheat it and yeah. you have to wait, and yada, yada. We got sure. one more way that we're gonna show you. It's by using a cast iron uh, uh, pot. I'm interested pan. to see this because I've never reheated pizza in a, in a, on if, the stove. The like first this. thing you have to do is get, get it nice and hot and you pour okay. a little bit of water in it. Okay, you gotta make sure it makes that noise. All right, you get your, grab me a slice of pizza that you want. Put it right in there. And you want to put it near the top, not on it. Oh, it's okay. Not in the water. Not okay. in the water at all. And you want to get oh, maybe a little bit more water than I put in there. So we're trying to just generate steam right Basic, now. Basic, and that's what we're doing. And then you put a top on it and keep it over there for about three minutes. And what's going to happen is, is all that steam coming up is going to be able to get on top of the uh, the cheese, and yeah. you're going to get it. So you can already see the steam yeah. kind of coming up in the shot. I'm surprised it doesn't make the bottom like too wet. You no, know? Well, that's the thing because it's cast because iron. It's going to keep oh, it. Oh, and you, because you're tilting. I'm it tilting too. it up. I'm keeping the heat up here, but yeah. I'm using this as moisture to be able to kind of uh, heat the milk nice. at the top of it. Now this takes about three or four minutes, so you're gonna be, first you need a cast iron uh, <laughs> a pan, cool, yeah. but you'll also be able to have to wait for it to cheese up and you have to watch it. And again, you're sitting mm. on the stove, so you definitely want to kind of keep your eye on it. All together, as nice. I said, this thing does work. It works. But if you're gonna spend $8 for this, and we mentioned they're kind of bulky. Yeah. This is one of those things, you better have a big kitchen and a, 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 a room where it's nothing but, for frivolous things to use just because And let's you be have honest, it. cold pizza isn't that bad. That's the, third way, that's the third way you eat old pizza, just, it's just, just cold. Just put it in, right? All right, check it out right at the top, and we'll talk about it right here. You can already see it melting right here. Look at the, the top of the nice. pizza, already getting a nice little uh, melting of the cheese. So how long do that. they do that for? About three minutes, and then you're done. So, to answer the question, does it work? It works! It works. Is it worth it? It's $8, you got eight bucks to spend. Go do it on the Easy Fresh. Pizza I freezing so. tray, reheating tray. There you go. Very good. Nice one. All right.